You. You. It's for you. <sighs> Over the ocean. Every reading, it's just signs. I'll hear a bell, I'll hear a siren. I get placed back in time. Like, I can actually see what's happening. Were you, like, going, like, it's like an island. Ocean. Were you in Hawaii? Yes. The wind, the wind, the tu like a tunnel, I'm hearing. Oh, God. Whew, many people died. Mm -hmm. Nine. I hear plane, and then I hear the explosion, the fire. I could, like, hear screeching and woo, really clear, and mm -hmm. I, they took me there. February 24th, 1989, I was on United Airlines flight 811, 22 miles out of um, Hawaii, 22,000 feet. There was a huge explosion on the plane, and I actually thought it was a bomb at the time. There was a faulty latch on the cargo door, which pulled off, pulling a 20 by 40 foot hole in the fuselage, and at the same time taking eight people out in business class, seats and floor, and a person across the aisle. The wind was unbelievable. It was just, it was just, the noise was, noise was amazing. It was like a hurricane inside the plane. You weren't supposed to be there. It's almost like you were supposed to be on that plane and then you got on or something's not right there. Something was changed. I was supposed to be in business class where the people got sucked out of and they changed to economy. Rosie zeroed in on that. And um, that was amazing. You have angels. Many of them saved you. They guided you. They just changed your destiny, your shift. 